Good morning guys. Uh, today's video I'm going to be doing my final sowing of uh, 2023 um, and if you've got a bit of space in your plot I'm going to suggest you sow this seed as well. So unfortunately before I can start planting I need to clear this bed of leeks. So unfortunately my leaf crop's been sort of uh, affected by allium leaf miner. I'll try and get a picture for you guys so you can see what I'm talking about but what it means is that I'm going to have to be a bit choosy on what leaks I can use and which ones I just have to put on the compost. But um, I'm going to get into this now. So unfortunately, that's all the leeks that I've got, and even some of them are a little bit questionable. Um, I've got my carrots though, which is, uh, you know, at least uh, somewhat rewarding, and I've now got a nice clear space for me to add some compost and um, get planting. So now that that's all done, the soil's pretty clear. As you can see, I've left lots of roots and bits of debris in. It'll just break down over time and add back to the soil. But I am going to give it the sort of annual mulch. Um, of compost. I haven't got to worry too much with this one because it's pretty um, it's pretty good soil anyway. This, it's had lots of stuff um, as the year's gone on as well. So um, yeah, that just uh, makes that look a bit neater. Now the seed we're going to be sowing today is broad beans. Um, this is a variety called Agualadus. Um, it's an autumn sowing variety. It can also be sown in like spring, spring and things, or sort of like late winter, but um, mainly for autumn sowing. So you can sow broad greens in January or whatever, and you'll do well. You'll get your crops sort of late June, beginning of July. But I think doing it this way, if the seedlings survive the winter, you'll get an even earlier crop. So that's all we're going to be really doing with this one. So I'll get a little picture of the beans. Little brown things, quite big seeds, and all you need to do is plant them about an inch down. Uh, they need quite a lot of space between them because, believe me, they will get quite big plants. So I'm going to sort of go for maybe, I don't know, almost 30 centimeters apart, sort of thing. Um, I'm just going to do about six plants, hopefully. Now, there is a chance that these won't survive the winter, it's a bit of a gamble. Um, but if they do, you're going to have a nice, um, robust, sort of early crop, which is brilliant. So we'll uh, have to wait and see what happens this winter if we get any more cold weather. But they should germinate as long as the sort of average temperatures are around about 10 degrees, the seeds should germinate. And they are sort of led to, I'm led to believe they're sort of resistant to frost to about minus 10 degrees Celsius, which here in the UK is quite rare for us. So I really hope you like this video. Don't forget, if you've got some spare space on the plot, you can always plant broad beans this time of year. Bit of a gamble, but if it pays off, you're gonna get a really early crop of um, broad beans, which will then free up that space again for your sort of summer planting. Um, so yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe. See you all soon for more videos.